Hello for Data Communications and Network One class today. Ajahn Usana will talk about carrying sense multiple access. This is a Mac layer protocol, the medium access control. Okay, or Mac, okay, protocol, okay, which are still active, okay, in the standard. Okay, in the old script, the, the previous clip we talked about like the old protocols, okay, in the standard that may not be active anymore. And we mentioned the CSMA, CD, CSMA, CA, which are the active standard, okay. So in this script, I will focus on this uh, protocols, okay. So the MAC layer or the, is the sub layer, okay, of the layer two, right. Of OSI module, okay. You have um, Mac sub layer and LLC sub layer, okay. For the layer two, uh, for LAN, local array network, okay. Um, the first one is ACSMACD, okay. This one is um, this one was very popular, okay. Um, and it's used in the CS, uh, I two point three Ethernet, okay. But this is the, the one that used the bus protocol, okay, not the switch. So it's kind of the older uh, Ethernet, okay. This is the bus that uses SMA, CD, okay, uh, Ethernet, okay. So the, um, the lower speed, okay. Um, use the system ACD for Ethernet, okay, but the higher speed like the uh, modern Ethernet that do switching uh, for gigabit Ethernet, okay, very high speed Ethernet, then they use the switch and they no longer use the system ACD. Anyway, uh, it was, uh, it's still active right now, the IEEE 2.3 Ethernet for the uh, system ACD is still an active standard right now. Okay, so we should learn about this and also uh, it will be related to the wireless LAN uh, technique. Okay, uh, so system ACD, the CD is the collision detection. Okay, and not used in Swiss Ethernet. Okay, uh, this one, system ACA, this is used in uh, 802.11, okay, wireless LAN, Wi Fi, okay, so this is a very active uh, protocol right now. Um, so CA is the collision avoidance, but actually the C CSMA CD, this is more efficient, okay, the CD is more efficient than uh, CA, okay, but there's some reason why we cannot use uh, the CD in the Wi Fi, and that's why. Um, in the past, okay, system ACD was very popular, more popular than CA. Okay, anyway, both of them are active uh, standard right now. And um, the idea, okay, if you remember, first we had um, Aloha, right? Aloha sent uh, the data without listening to the medium, okay? If they want to send, they just send, okay? But because we know that propagation delay time between stations very small, okay, usually very small for, because it's local area network, okay. Local area network means that the station are close together, okay. So they can learn, uh, they can see the signal that the other station sent almost immediately, okay. So when a st station start to transmit a frame, uh, all other station will know this almost in. Immediately, so if you listen to the medium or the channel before transmitting, okay, you can avoid a lot of collisions, okay. So this is developed, um, you know, from the Aloha that is, that was sending at will, okay. Want to send just send, system A, uh, system, they listen to the medium before transmitting, okay. And um, the frame transmission time, okay, usually is much longer than the propagation delay time. So if you can avoid the collision, okay, you can, um, and I mean, if you listen to the medium first, you avoid a lot of collision. 
And if you listen to the medium after, okay, you did you can detect the collision, and you can reduce um the collision time. Okay, so that was done in the system ACD. Okay, strategy. I have talked about this, uh, before in the previous clip, but I just put it here to make it complete. Okay, so anyway, strategy for CSMA is that it carries sense mean that if a station what want to send um data it will first listen to the medium to see if it is any other transmission in progress or not if the medium is busy station will not transmit the data so no collision if the medium seem available it will transmit so reduce the chance of collision but not foolproof because collision can still occur when you have more than one station okay try to transmit almost at the same time if you think about um, when you talk to your friends, okay, you may have experienced this that you and your friends like start talking almost at the same time, and you and you will say then you stop ah ah you go first something like that okay because you uh you listen before um you you think no one is speaking right but you and your friends both start fit, start talking at almost the same time so it collide okay so it's not foolproof but. Um, if the collision occur, data will be retransmit. Like you go first, I, uh, and then I will talk later or something like that. Okay, to avoid a uh, collision. Okay, now let's compare the system A, system A C D, and system A C A. System A C D is used in eight hundred two point three Ethernet. Okay, which is a wire. Um, network. Okay, system A C D. Uh, CDCA is used in the eight hundred two point eleven wireless. Okay, LAN. Okay. Um, all of them listen to the medium before transmitting. Okay, before. Okay, but for the CD collision detection, they uh, also listen while transmitting the data. Okay, so during the transmission, they also listen. Okay, now um. So system A and system A C A, they keep sending the whole frame, whether there is any collision or not. Okay, because it that they does not detect the collision, right? It does not detect collision, so keep sending the whole frame. Okay, but system A C D stop sending when detect collision, and this reduce the collision period. Okay, um, the system A I will have an example in a little bit. Okay. For the system A um and system uh for system A C A, you want collision by first um transmit the intent to send, but this is this is optional. This is not required in the standard. Okay, optional, um. But it does not detect collision. So if the if they collide, okay, they will collide for the whole frame. The same as system A, uh. All of them are in the MAC layer, okay? So system ACA try to minimize probability of collision, but do not detect collision and can collide for the whole frame. Now let's look at the system ACD example. Uh, this is the Ethernet bus. Okay, and you have uh, three stations and they are all uh, adjacent station a diameter apart, okay? And if TP is a propagation time for the demeter, okay? Station B want to send, okay? When it's sent, it will send to both direction. Um, okay, want to send at T equal to zero. And this is the B frame, okay? Uh, so B send here. Actually, B frame would be like very, very long, okay? Very long, okay? But because, okay, so this is B, okay? What happened is that at a little bit after T equal to zero, okay? C want to send. C listen to the medium here, listen, okay? At this uh, tab, okay? And it ha it doesn't see any signal because uh B frame is not arriving yet, okay. B frame will arrive at time T T P right, but it's not T P yet. This is T equal to zero. This is T P. Ah, uh, sorry. 
uh, yes, this is TP. Okay, so doesn't see uh, anything. The channel seems available, so it sent C frame, send signal. Okay, so it collide. Okay, there's collision. Uh, when when it collide, okay, uh, it will learn the station will learn. Okay, at the tab here. So B learn the collision at this time, at this point. B C collision. Stop sending the data. Okay. So at this point. So not sending. Okay. So this is already sent. This is already sent. Okay. This is not sending. Ah. Then at this point, TP, uh, C C the collision, okay? Because C the signal from B, right? So it stops sending the data. So C, okay. This is the time, okay? And this is C frame. C got stop sending. C send here and then it stops sending. So actually, C frame and B frame are are uh, much longer than this, okay? But it because it stops sending, so it become short like this. So this is a C frame and it's actually continue here. Ah, okay. And this they collide, okay? They collide so the whole thing cannot be used. Okay, they collide. Okay, so fail. Okay, need to retransmit. Okay, this is fail. Fail. Okay. Um but because B and C detect collision, it will stop sending immediately, okay, when it learn about um, other people's signal, okay, while they are transmitting, so so it reduce the collision period, okay, to be uh, shorter, okay, this is what I just talked about, B send, I put it here so that you can also read it, um, at time B send at time equal to zero, uh, a little time later, so you want to send sense the medium first. The medium seems available, so it sends the data out. Collision occur. Okay. When C detect collision, stop sending. B detect collision, stop sending also. Okay, so reduce the collision period. Okay. Um, now let's look at uh, the vulnerable time. Okay. Uh, that it can collide because I told you that the Station will learn about um at the station sending okay at almost almost immediately okay so actually the chance of collision is not a lot okay by listening to the medium first so let's see what is the vulnerable time that uh they send and collide okay look at the case one okay uh we see this example before right in the previous uh slide okay. If C come here, uh, this is TP, right? If C want to send here, C sends the medium and BC, okay? C come at this point, ah, it's BC. In, in, instead of coming at this point, okay? Uh, C come at this point, uh, it will not send, right? Because uh, C know that medium is BC, okay? So, I mean, the, the same examples here but B send at this time right and C come at this time ah, C sends medium B C so B C is not sending okay so no collision okay another case is if this is t equal to zero. If uh, this is minus t p, okay. If c come here, okay. Before, before t minus t p, okay. C, and so c is sending right. C send then b come here at this time. B will not send, okay. Okay, so if c were to send before this time. T P second before T equal to zero. Uh, T equal to zero is just a reference time. For example, it's noon, eleven o'clock, something like that. So this is the 
before t you know before this time, uh before the reference time. Okay, uh. So B will learn that medium is B C. So B will not send and no collision. Okay. So C send. Okay. Ah, uh, and then B come at this time. This is uh before minus T P. This is time before minus T P. So so B come at this time at T equal to zero. We will not send, okay? And no collision. So you will send successfully. So whenever period, okay, that the frame may collide is from minus TP to TP, which is equal to only to 2 TP. So if TP is very small, uh, this is also very small, okay? If you send um, at other time, they will not have collision because they will learn that other people are sending, okay? Only during this time, Okay, minus uh, TP to 2 TP. This is the 2 TP period. That can collide, okay? The time that they want to send and you collide with each other, but if they come at other time, they will not collide. Now let's uh, emphasize a little bit on the system ACA because I told you that system CD is better, more efficient. But why we are using system ACA in the wireless LAN? Okay, the N O two point eleven wireless LAN use system ACD, not 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 CA because it is half duplex. When you send wireless, okay, when you send, you cannot listen at the same time. Okay, you can either send or listen. You cannot do both at the same time. Okay, this is the main reason that you cannot detect collision while you are sending okay but wire ethernet okay uh, this one this is full duplex okay you can send and receive at the same time so this one choose the csma cd but again more than um, higher very high speed ethernet gigabit ethernet they are not using um, the system ACD anymore, they use a uh, switch Ethernet, okay? Uh, a lot of reference here because I try to check, um, you know, the up most updated uh, information, okay? Thank you very much.